excessive moments of now. However, there are some things about our, our humanity we all know but can't prove. So if you ask a neuroscientist and a poet what love is, although both may be correct in what they say, you'll get two very different answers. We all know what love feels like, but you can't put it under a... Right, so you saw me draw this, and it's mediocre at best, and I want to make it better. So what I did off camera, um, purely because it was just too dark to film in here, um, and I couldn't do it in here anyway, is I sweet talked to a friend of mine. And I borrowed a projector for a laptop. Uh, I used the same picture that I had to draw the other one, um, but I just projected the image onto this and it needed about a 10 metre reach, so it was any bigger than this, I wouldn't have been able to do it because I didn't have the room um, to project this on. And then I just sketched around and kind of touched up a few places because when you increase the picture size that much, even with a high resolution picture, each pixel was visible and it was about four or five mil square. Um, so it was quite a rough image to go with and it needed still a little bit of interpretation. But proportionally, I think it looks better. Um, the next thing I'm gonna do is mark out where I want the, the scale to be and then I can route that, route in the detail and then cut the image out ready for spraying.
Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. I certainly had a lot of fun um, making it. Before I sort of go into this anymore, I want to thank, um, first and foremost, Steve Twydell. I think this is a fantastic, brilliant idea and cause. And obviously, um, if you're looking to take it on further, I think you talked about um, other kind of charitable collaborations coming up. If you want to find out a little bit more about that, then check down in the description for Steve's visit on our podcast, Makes International. Enough of that shameless plug. Um, but yeah, thanks, Steve. This has been um, stressful, but it's been a lot of fun as well. Um, it's not quite finished. The reason it's not quite finished um, is all these videos coming out today, which should be Saturday if you're watching this kind of straight away. Um, but now when I'm recording this, it's actually Thursday afternoon. I've got about an hour of light left and there's not enough time I want to put um, a couple of coats of clear lacquer on it to seal it in properly. And also I want to mark the numbers on the scale. Um, but apart from that, it's basically done. I'm just not going to have enough time in the next hour to do two coats of spray lacquer and for it to dry because it's really, really cold in here. It's literally like a couple of degrees above freezing. Um, and I've actually been helping it along with the heat gun um, where needed for um, between coats. And I started first thing this morning. Anyway, enough of that. Um, if I was going to do it again, and I think I will make something like this again, I'd probably use exactly the same technique that I, you saw me use to route the scale, but I'd route that into a jig, um, and then I can just lay it on and, and it'd be a lot quicker to, uh, to route the jig. But the, the very jig system that I used that you see in the video was great for that. It's the first time I've used it in that format to do that scale, and it worked perfectly, which is good. Um, there's also quite a lot of freehand routing on here, which I don't do very much of, and I was a little bit kind of nervous about it, which is why you saw me really going in and highlighting the, um, the lines. But uh, apart from that, I'm, I'm actually really chuffed um, the way it turned out. So um, big thanks to Steve. Um, also a big thanks to the guys down in Bracknell at 3M for supplying the painters IPE. Um, and the goggles, they, they're really comfy and they work really well. And you'll be seeing me wearing those more and more. Um, yeah, it's, it was great fun. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe, um, comment, share and all the rest of it. But if you do nothing else, if you, if you just completely ignore all calls to action, um, go and watch those other videos for this collaboration. And if you are in a position to, please, 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 Dig deep, put your hands in your pockets and support this fantastic charity for autistic kids all over the world. We'll see you back here next time for another uh, build video, probably more routing. Um, yeah, we'll see you soon.